Get ready, WWE Universe. It's Buzz. And yes, indeed, we are back. Introducing the new champion from Brooklyn, New York, weighing in at 241 pounds. Did you guys see the, the WWE 24 episode of Outpost? I highly recommend it. Yeah, yeah you, you also, also highly, highly recommend, recommend a sushi joint when we're in Topeka. Topeka. I think I'm going to pass. Wow. I actually have a, a WWE 24 on the WWE Network. Let's see how this is going to be. Kevin Owens, Sami Zayn, Bobby Roode, and Trey Kent for one title. All of these guys want to have the championship. But okay. Time to settle this. Doing all the emphasis. I want to get right to the match. Trey Kent, Bobby Roode, Kevin Owens, and Sami Zayn in a fatal four way. Uh oh. Oh. Somewhat of an easy picking for me. Challenger not looking good right now. Yep, 
wonder how much the challenger can sustain at this point. This is where we find out. He is in first place. But he's got to capitalize now. No. Jeez, I don't like saying he's in this one. The champion into the cover. The finisher could absolutely end this match, my boy, as you were saying. But it's not a guarantee. Sometimes it takes two or even three to get the job done. And even then, it's not a sure bet. A la Randy Savage versus the Ultimate Warrior at WrestleMania 7. It's my favorite match of all time. Randy Savage landed an amazing five top rope elbow drop, but was still unable to put Warrior away. And you know what? He probably could have hit him with five more. There was just no stopping the Warrior on that. We may very well be seeing the finisher here very shortly, guys. And when that happens, you can bet this one. What the heck? When this guy's on, look at him. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Sandy Zane has eyes to finish. One move after the other. It's devastating. There it is. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. works. You can't teach the nope. type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. Oh, that was close. Oh! And the champ kicks out. Still too fresh. Yeah, everybody... Oh my god. Counter, man. What is going on? Attention to him, what are you doing? Nicely executed. Man, Kevin Owens. Oh, the dude nice. grab a hold on him for once. Kevin Owens is a close oh, man. Kevin Owens. The champion into the cover. Two, three. And that's their one. Ha 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 My goodness. DVR because that was a match you're going to want to watch. And the Bobby again, was, was and calling and after and he took the finishing yeah. move. But then I still get the win. Spice I'm surprised. The Triple H is disappointed. He somehow beat the odds to win the Fatal Boy match. I told you he had a chance to win. Are you shocked, Corey? Yes, I'm shocked that for once you were right. still United as champion. Let's go. That's right. Bad of scars. That's my theme song right there.
Come on now. That money in the bank ladder match was awesome. Congrats on walking out with the briefcase. Thanks. To be honest, what? it's gonna be kind of annoying carrying this around with me. And seeing as you're the rookie, how about you carry it around for me? Oh. <laughs> no thanks. I already got my hands full. Huh. I'll remember that. The United States champion is here on SmackDown Live, fresh off a successful title defense at Money oh. in the Bank. Oh. Randy Orton. I don't care about the others, but Randy Orton. Talking to Triple H and coming on to Sami Zayn. Ain't that something? I was talking to Kevin Owens and Sami Zayn, and I've decided that they're both going to get another shot at your U.S. title. What the hell? Fine. I have no problem being those guys again. Which one of them do you want me to face tonight? I swear to God, this dude better not say handicap match. I said they're both going to get a shot at your U.S. title in a two-on-one handicap match. If you thought the odds were against you in a fatal four-way, just wait until tonight. That is some bull. That is some bull. After we beat you tonight, we're going to be co-U.S. champions. If that somehow were to happen, I don't think it's fair. I mean, if Kevin pins me, shouldn't he be the champion? And vice versa? He makes a good point. It is only fair. He is just trying to drive us apart before the match. And besides, we had a deal all worked out in writing. I faxed it to you, remember? I don't have a fax machine. It's 2018. I'm pretty sure you do. It made the fax noise. <laughs> Sammy, Sammy, stop. Sammy, I get it. Stop. I get it. So do we have a deal then? Co-champions? Yes, as long as you never make that noise again. Oh my goodness. Would have been better if it was like a cat a cut scene or something. But yeah, uh we got uh Randy Orton over here. I saw you talking to Triple H. What was that all about? You want to shut up my, my U.S. championship? If I wanted your U.S. title, I wouldn't need to ask anyone for permission. I'd just take it. Oh. You're welcome to try and talk. Stay out of my way unless you want an RKO. <laughs> an RKO? I'd rather give you the one and done. But anyway. Let's go to the match. Let's go to the match. The wait, the wait is, is over. over. This, this one's, one's for all the marbles, and it's coming, coming up next. next. We have we one have of our, our breakout, breakout talents against Team Kevin, Kevin Owens. Owens. Can't, Can't ask, ask for more, more than, than a title, title match. match. So far, it has been 12 minutes, if I'm correct. My goodness. The crowd is buzzing with excitement. Buzz is here. Introducing the next champion from Brooklyn, New York, weighing in at 241 pounds. Soon there will be a tight tron.
these guys want a shot at my title because of Triple H saying so on SmackDown Live. First of all, he's supposed to be the boss all the way to NXT, not SmackDown Live. But he want to make my life a living hell? And so be it, because I'm going to fight my way out of it. He's right. Jumping knee strike on point. Yet again, Triple H is stacking the deck against Buzz tonight in his two on one U.S. title handicap match. He's able to overcome the odds of money in the bank, so I'm willing to bet he can do it again here tonight. He may not have to if KO and Sammy are unable to work together. You never know what can happen with Superstar's ego when there's a title on the line. Don't be ridiculous, Cole. Kevin Owens and Sammy Zayn are professionals. They know what's at stake, and they're not going to let jealousy or anything else get in the way. Guys, a loss here for the champion would be incredibly embarrassing, especially considering all the trash talking I'm told has been going on behind the scenes. I don't want to reveal my sources, but let's just say there's been some pretty harsh words being tossed Come on, Kev. What's going on? Kevin Owens may be in a bad way here. You can bet he's not going to let this oh. opportunity slip so easily. I don't know who your sources are, Corey, but it wouldn't surprise me at all to learn that the champion has been a little cocky heading into this one. There's nothing wrong with that, Michael, especially considering just how dominant the champ has been of late. When you're that good, you have every right to bow your chest out a little bit. Face. I'm just doing knee strikes at the knee strikes. Obviously a great opportunity here for the challenger who can't afford to make any mistakes here tonight. Not when you're in the ring with a champion as dominant as this one. Uh, I don't trust him. He's in, uh, I don't trust him. Oh wow. What a combination. You just don't know what's coming next. I was just about to text Sandy Zane to Oh but not for a second do I expect him to back down now. He may very well find himself on the wrong end of this decision if he doesn't come up with something quicker. This match is so evenly contested right now that it's almost impossible to pick a winner. I guess we'll just have to settle in and enjoy the action. If you ask me, fellas, this championship match is among the most highly anticipated that we've seen in quite some time. Nicely done. Keep your eye on this one. Oh, nah. Nope. Championship match on my radar for quite some time so far. I think it's safe to say, nicely done as he gets out of the submission. But we surprised Michael. I did not see that one coming. When this guy's on, look at him. He's going for it all. Look at this. Got the elbow drop. Around the city earlier today, guys. The only thing anybody was talking about was this title match. Everywhere it went, from the coffee shop to the bookstore. What does Buzz have in store? We're about to find a beautiful swinging neck breaker. Here's his chance. He's got him covered. And a kick out punch to nobody's surprise. Right, I had a similar experience as you this morning. Nearly every person at the gym I went to was talking about this title match, and rightfully so. This is an absolutely huge match. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Let me get this straight. Byron spent the morning at the bookstore, while you, Cole, went to the gym. That's brilliant. You guys ever have any jokes? 
There we go. There we go. It's over. One and done. What the? Oh, no, no, no. Oh my god. Cricket Randy Orton came out of nowhere with the RKO. Damn you. Damn you. Randy! Oh boy. He just came out of nowhere with the RKO. What the hell? Oh boy. title match but no time to worry about that leave for big tour of Japan in two days I have a special surprise for you when we get there I see I see oi my goodness podcast my friend nah Let's do another. Oh, oh, go to Japan. I see. Oh, this is the van. Oh, wow. I just realized. It's the van. My goodness. next day hmm. I'm, I'm sleeping oh wait no I just woke up And like he's like, I'm actually going to Japan. Shinsuke, AJ. I'm really looking forward to this trip. What's that? Because Triple H is not on it, 
And I'm excited to see your match against Nakamura, of course. Depending on how that goes, you might have a match at the Dome for our big WWE Network special. Ah, the Tokyo Dome. That would be amazing. I hope it works out. Well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Before all that, I've arranged for you to take on an up-and-coming star from a Japanese promotion. You know, to help shake off any jet lag. Who is it? I think it'll be more fun if it's a surprise. I see. <laughs> I speak no English. Shinsuke Nakamura. Glad you are getting your rest. You are going to need it when you face me in Japan. I heard you personally requested to wrestle me in front of your native fans. Let me just say, it's an honor. Yes. It will be a no there. The same with you starting at the right. Mm -hmm. And AJ Styles. Let's see what this man has to say. If SmackDown Live is the house that AJ Styles built, then the foundation was constructed in Japan. I learned that the audience there respects traditions like the fighting spirit and hard-hitting matches. And since it's your first trip, you better bring it. Don't worry. I always do. There's one other Japanese tradition that you need to know. On your first trip, you're going to buy all the veterans dinner. Hope you brought your credit card. <laughs> this guy. This guy. Let's go to the match. Oh, I hit Mickey James. Buzz, first time competing in Japan. He's been a fan of Japanese wrestling for years. However, collecting videos and watching matches online. Your opponent tonight has been creating quite the buzz of his own recently as one of this country's hottest new stars. So I'm excited to see you two face each other for the very first time in Japan. Oh! He had a surprise opponent lined up, and he definitely delivered. Yeah, what? for those of you watching this WWE.com exclusive, get ready to witness something Cole special. Quinn. To catch everyone up to speed, Cole Quinn and Buzz have a long history on the indie circuit. Most recently, they invaded NXT with the now disgraced Baron Blade. Since then, Cole's made a name for himself in Japan, while Buzz has done the same on SmackDown Live. By the look on Buzz's face, he probably didn't expect to see his friend in the ring again anytime soon. Nonetheless, we're all lucky to see it happen. I am surprised. I'm facing Cole Quinn. What? Let's go. Ring the bell, please. Come on, Cole. I am surprised. Oh. Nope. Oh my god, countering at the counter. I heard one more time. I heard that. There's some cold coin. Cover one, no. It was a no count. I could have sworn I was going to fight Shinsuke. Uh, I believe that's later tonight. Oh! Those kicks. Oh! Beautiful combination hits. By Trey Kent to Cole Quinn. I wish whip. Oh! Close line. Oh! 
Oh, whoa. Got a debuff before he hit me. Two, three, oh, oh, and the back suplex. In the wood did I turn around if I was gonna go for Irish whip? That didn't make no sense. Come on. Super kick. Okay. Cole, I'm sorry. But it has to be done. Kicks out. Ah, uh, I can't go. I can't go that far for some reason. Oh, what the heck? Oh, up his combat. He's doing it again.
What started in high school gyms in the U.S. has now added a new chapter in Japan. This is truly a special moment. And this is only our first night here. We will get to see Buzz versus Nakamura. And then there's the WWE Network special from the Dome. I do this for free. Don't give him any ideas, Byron. Thanks again for joining us from Japan for this WWE.com exclusive. My goodness. That was that was a surprise. My goodness, man. You said you had a successful Japanese debut last night. But tonight, you face the king of Songsan in his kingdom. And you will be lucky to go back to America with all your teeth. Does it really say all that? More or less. Dolly. This is going to be a match. Great cat taking on Shinsuke Nakamura. I cannot wait. Okay, Nakamura. A facing a former NXT United States champion. Konanashika. Nakamura, the king of strong style, man. I had a figure for it, then I had a handicap match. Then I'm going to Japan. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I understand this is your country, but Jesus. Oh, boy. It's crazy that you can't win by a count out. What the? Yo, can I count it? <laughs> Holy crap! A 
That's the buzz that I miss. Pay attention. You talk with the fans. Oh, German. I didn't expect to have that in my moveset. a bit far away from my television. I'm about to use my combat right now. I got no choice. I got no choice. Super kick. This shit's getting knocked the ball. No. Ah. Uh, I just got King Shasa. Well, look at that. I got to start over. I think the shit's gonna knock him off for God's sakes. My overall is low. So far it's been 50 minutes, I believe. If I'm correct. If not, then 40 something minutes. Matter of fact, no, no, no. It's only it's been forty minutes and change. Can't counter. Damn. Wait a minute. No, I can't. I have this freaking payback. Payback reversal. What the heck are you gonna do? You gonna beat me by a ten count? Wow. That is not the direction that I was trying to go to. Did even actually connect to him. There we go. Oh, wow. 
what the heck? Brain job. Got him. Yeah, okay. Oh, what did I see up? That's how it is. Oh my goodness. What the? Here we go. Super kick. Holy crap. That's a sick. Here we go, one and done. Yes. And I am the winner. I am Venice. Talk about making an impression on your first tour of Japan. Not only was Buzz able to pull out a victory, he did it on Nakamura's home turf. That's impressive. Hold on. You may have gotten that win tonight. But next time, it's in definitely. Need to face. Need to face. Man, I want to give you a few need to faces, man. We hope, we hope you enjoyed, you enjoyed this WWE.com exclusive. Be sure to join us tomorrow on the WWE Network as we bring you a huge special event live from Japan. My goodness. That's right, these battle scars, man. All those fights and matches and Stories to tell. My goodness. The next day. AJ Styles. Shinsuke. Hey, go get your wrestling gear on. Oscar. I thought he didn't have a match tonight on the network special. After what I saw you do against Cole Quinn and then Shinsuke, you do now. I'm changing the scheduled AJ Styles versus Nakamura match to a triple threat, and you're the third participant. 
Whoa. So I get to wrestle at the dome? On the network special? Tonight? Yes, but not if you don't get ready. So go. Now. Go. Holy crap. I'm going to free Shinsuke Nakamura and AJ Styles at the dome. Holy crap. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we will see you guys for more WWE 2K19 My Career. So I'm Trick Kent and I am out of here. Peace.